Uh, in front of me here, I'm going to share very good news and it's something which immigrants should pay attention on, on some of the opportunities. And today I'm going to share about one of the small business administration loan uh, for people who are here in the United States. And basically, you have to be a permanent resident or a U.S. citizen to go through. So you can see here, this is my application. And I have been approved for 18,000 U.S. dollar. And you can see here, you can read your application has been approved. There are a few processes I've gone through until I got that approval. And I want to share some this information because myself, I came to know this one very, very late. Uh, but I decided to go ahead. Uh, one of the person is also Tanzanian, but American citizen, but original from Tanzania went through this process and he said, oh, there is this information. Do you know about this one? Because he got the loan uh, and he, he wanted me, to, if I know about it, he said, I do not know because I assumed you must have the actual business. You have been registered and you have been for quite some time. So this is why I'm going to share with you. So there is something is called the COVID-19 EIDL, which is Economic Injury Disaster Loan. You can see just like it is here. Uh, I don't know if I need to put it a little bit bigger. You can be able to see. So this is economic uh, injury disaster loan. There are different types of loan under SBA, uh, which is a small business administration. Uh, so this type of loan, uh, which we are talking about, is a federal loan for small business loan programs, uh, program supports which is supporting uh, small business recovery from COVID-19 disaster economic impacts by providing accessible and borrower uh, friendly capital. So there are so many things inside this one you need to know about it, uh, but just in a very high level, uh, this type of loan, uh, you can be, uh, it is a low interest, it doesn't go more than three, it doesn't go more than four. Uh, the one uh, interest I got is a 3.75, that's my interest. And you pay for 30 years, but if you want to pay quicker, it's up to you. Uh, number two, uh, this type of loan, uh, you pay, you start paying after two years. So you don't pay right now. So because we are almost in January 2021, I mean 2022, I will start paying after 2023, 2024, I'm starting paying. Uh, I'm starting paying 2024. So 2022, will, I will be have grace period. 2023, grace period, I'm starting paying uh, the year 2024. And I'll be paying $95 per month. That is how it is. The maximum amount to get this type of loan is $2 million. But this one, any loan above a half a million, you already let to apply. The deadline to apply this loan, uh, it is... Uh, December 31st, I'll go to show you. So the term limit uh, is 30 years. As I say, the, for the business is 3.75, but if you are a nanny profit, I didn't apply as a nanny profit, though I've just recently opened my nanny profit. Uh, you have deferred for the first two years. That's number one. Number two, which is very important, is this one. If you get any loan, uh, for 25,000 or less, there is no any fees which I applied for that. And number two, you don't need to pay any collateral for the loan uh, less than 25,000. So if it is starting 25,000 uh, greater than that one, that is when you, you pay for collateral in that particular sense. But the loan greater than 25,000, you pay one time a hundred dollar fee. So that is something uh, you need to also pay attention on that. Uh, so uh, greater than this amount. So for me, I applied as a self, uh, self employment. You can do that. So you don't need to go and is uh, LLC. You can go as sole proprietor company, and that's what I did. And there is application form here. Uh, but later you can apply the increase if you want down the road through the portal. Uh, so this is the application form. I will put the link there. But remember, the deadline for this application for this loan is in December 31st. That is the deadline for the application. So you see, it is even bolded here. So you have one week left for people to apply if you qualify for that. 
so they'll be able to approve. What you need, apart from applying, filling the form, they will ask you for the, uh, obviously you have to fill, fill your social, uh, then they will ask for your uh, bank information, they will ask uh, for the tax return 2019-2020, those are the things they will need for you to have, uh, and then they'll be able to process, they'll run your credit, and they'll be able to do that. Uh, so for me, I chose uh, my um, the business, I'm applicant with the business, uh, not more than 50 uh to 500 employees that's what i chose i think uh yeah and then the questions are normal of the questions they want to know how much you own all those kind of things and then uh you fill the form then you go to the next you put the amount and the other few things you go up to that particular area so once you do that way uh it will go to uh to you complete the application Verify identification, then they'll do a, a disbursement, and then you upload the documents which are required. So for me, because everything is done, I have to go and accept because now it has been uh, confirmed because I had a call with them. Uh, they wanted some few more quick information, so I had to do that. So th those are the few things uh, I wanted to know that. Uh, so those are the few things I wanted to do. So. Uh, so already the tax information is already there, so the only agreement. So then I'm going to sign, and that will be all, and that is how I'm going to do. So I'm not going to all those details, but that's what I want to share with you about that one. So the information is there. I put the link for the application form and the link about the economic injury, the this one, so that you can be able to do that. Uh, as I said, you can go as sole proprietor, or you can go... Uh, is what we call uh, if you have LLC, limited company by uh, 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 the liability, whatever the limited liability company, whatever LLC or any type of a corporation, you can be able to do that. If you have a non profit, you get even less interest rate. So you can be using this one for the opportunity to increase your business. For me, I'm going to use this one is to grow my self business and my self business is uh content creation which will be more on youtube uh getting more uh equipment improving my office improving the productivity to make more videos so i'm going to use the money into all those kind of areas where i'll be able to do that so getting the best camera going to renovate most of the things and to make it easier on my end to be able to uh to utilize all the resources i have so that I can be able to improve in one way or another. So thank you so much. And please share this information to other people who you think that they can be able to benefit from this one. Uh, as I said, it is 30 years loan, very small interest rate. You never know, you can get it and you don't need to pay right now. You pay, you start paying after two years. If you think this one is a good idea for you and you need it, just go ahead and uh, utilize this one. And again, this is... Uh, COVID-19 Economic Injury Disaster Loan from SBA. So thank you so much. This is EBM Ernest Boniface Makulilo and please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Goodbye and may God bless you. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year everyone.